Question number 16. What does a pump develops flow or pressure? Answer. A pump does not create pressure, it only creates flow. Pressure is a measurement of the re Question number 17. What is operating pressure? Answer. The amount of pressure nearest the point of performing work at the output end of a pneumatic system. The system operating pressure is used to specify the capability of valves and actuators. Operating pressure is the ideal pressure at which an element can operate effectively. Its range lies between minimum to the maximum pressure. Out of this range of operating pressure the element may get destruction. Question number 18. Which pump is more efficient centrifugal pump or reciprocating pump? Answer. Centrifugal pump. Because flow rate is higher compared to reciprocating pump. Flow is smooth, and it requires less space to install. Lower initial cost and lower maintenance cost. Question number 19. Why centrifugal pump is not called as a positive displacement type of pump? Answer. The centrifugal has varying flow depending on pressure or head, whereas the positive displacement pump has more or less constant flow regardless of pressure. Likewise viscosity is constant for positive displacement pump, where centrifugal pump have up and down value, because the higher viscosity liquids fill the clearances of the pump causing a higher volumetric efficiency. When there is a viscosity change in supply there is also greater loss in the system. This means change in pump flow affected by the pressure change. One more example is, positive displacement pump has more or less constant efficiency, where centrifugal pump has varying efficiency rate. Question number 20. Why the centrifugal pump is called high discharge pump? Answer. Centrifugal pump is a kinetic device. The centrifugal pump uses the centrifugal force to push out the fluid. So the liquid entering the pump receives kinetic energy from the rotating impaler. The centrifugal action of the impaler accelerates the liquid to a high velocity, transferring mechanical, rotational energy to the liquid. So it discharges the liquid in high rate. Question number 21. What is cavitation? And effect of cavitation? Answer. Cavitation, the formation, growth and collapse of vapor-filled cavities or bubbles in a flowing liquid due to local fall in fluid pressure is called cavitation. The cavitation in a hydraulic machine affects in the following ways. A. It causes noise and vibration of various parts. B. It makes surface rough. C. It reduces the discharge of a turbine. D. It causes sudden drop in power output and efficiency. Question number 22. Why cavitation will occur in centrifugal pumps and not in displacement pumps? Answer. The formation of cavities or bubbles, is induced by flow separation, or non-uniform flow velocities, inside a pump casing. In centrifugal pumps the eye of the pump impeller is smaller than the flow area of pipe. This decrease in flow area of pump results in increase in flow rate. So pressure drop happen between pump suction, and the veins of the impeller. Here air bubbles or cavities are formed, because of liquid vapor due to increase in temperature in impeller. This air bubbles are transmitted to pump which forms cavitation. Question number 23. How cavitation can be eliminated in a pump? Answer. Cavitation means bubbles are forming in the liquid. To avoid cavitation, we have to increase the pump size to 1 or 2 inch to increase the pressure of the suction head or decrease the pump speed. Question number 24. Where multi-stage pump used? Answer, pressure washing of aircraft, trains, boats, and road vehicles as well as spray washing of industrial parts and electronic components. Question number 25. Which two seal oil pumps are driven from the same motor? Answer, main seal oil pump and recircular seal oil pump. Both are driven by main seal oil pump motor. Question number 26. When does emergency seal oil pump automatically start? Answer. When its pressure switch senses main seal oil pump discharge pressure reduced to 78 psi. When supply oil header pressure falls below the predefined pressure value initiated by pressure sensing device. Question number 27. Which two seal oil pumps are driven from the same motor? Answer. Main seal oil pump and recircular seal oil pump. Both are driven by main seal oil pump motor. Question number 28. What is compressor? Answer. A device that produces pressure, such as a gas compressor, that produces pressurized gas. Question number 29. How many types of compressor? 
Answer. The three basic types of air compressors are, reciprocating, rotary screw rotary centrifugal. Question number 30. How is a fly ball governor used with a hydraulic control? Answer. As the turbine speeds up, the weights are moved outward by centrifugal force, causing linkage to open a pilot valve that admits and releases oil on either side of a piston or on one side of a spring-loaded piston. The movement of the piston controls the steam valves. Question number 31. What is PS? Answer. PS is Fertestirk, the German unit for horsepower. PS is a German unit of a horsepower. Horsepower or BHP. PS and BHP are same, but both are used in automobiles. Question number 32. What is the difference between hydraulics and pneumatics? Answer. The difference between hydraulics and pneumatics are given below. Question number 33. Define Reynolds number, Frout's number, Weber's number, Euler's number, and Mach's number. Answer. Reynolds number. The ratio of inertial forcing viscous force is called Reynolds number. It is a dimensionless number. It determines the type of fluid flow. Frout's number. The ratio of the inertia force to the gravity force is called Frout's number. Weber's number. The ratio of the inertia force to the surface tension force is called Weber's number. Euler's number. The ratio of the inertia force to the pressure force is called Euler's number. Mach's number. The ratio of actual velocity, V, of fluid in an undisturbed steam to the velocity of sound wave or sonic velocity, C, is known as Mach number. Question number 34. What is Magnus effect? Explain Mach number. Answer. Magnus effect. Magnus observed experimentally that, if the cylinder in a parallel flow stream is rotated about its axis, a transverse force, which tends to move the cylinder across the parallel flow steam, is generated. This is known as Magnus effect or aerodynamic lift. Mach's number, the ratio of actual velocity, V, of fluid, in an undisturbed steam, to the velocity of sound wave or sonic velocity, C, is known as Mach number. The flow of fluid is divided into the following four types depending upon the Mach number. When the Mach number is less than unity, the flow is called a subsonic flow. When the Mach number is equal to unity, the flow is called a sonic flow. When the Mach number is between 1 to 6, the flow is called a supersonic flow. When the Mach number is more than 6, the flow is called a hypersonic flow. Question number 35. What is stagnation point? Answer. Stagnation point. A singular point in the flow, where the velocity of fluid is zero, is called stagnation point. Question number 36. What is NPSH? Answer. NPSH. NPSH means net positive suction head. The net positive suction head is defined as the difference between the net inlet head and the head corresponding to the vapor pressure of the liquid. It may be noted that, when the pressure at the suction falls below the vapor pressure of the liquid, then cavitation will be formed. Question number 37. Describe draft tube and its applications. Answer. The draft tube is a pipe of gradually increasing area used for discharging water from the exit of a reaction turbine. It is an integral part of mixed and axial flow turbines. Question number 38. What is the function of surge tank, draft tube and penstock? Answer. Surge tank. A surge tank introduced in the system between the dam and powerhouse nearest to the powerhouse and preferably on the high ground to reduce the height of the tower to provide better regulation of water pressure in the system during variable load conditions. The surge tank helps in stabilizing the velocity and pressure in penstock and reduces the water hammer effect. Draft tube. The main function of the draft tube is the recovery of the pressure head and prevents a part of KE otherwise going to waste at the tail race. To prevent cavitation at the exit of the runner. Penstock, a pipe between the surge tank and prime mover is known as penstock. It has to bear very high pressure on inside surface during decreased load conditions on generator and on onside surface during increased load conditions on generator. In very cold weather conditions, it is sometimes advised to bury the penstock to prevent the ice formation in the pipe and reduce the number of expansion joints required. Question number 39. Explain slip and reciprocating pumps. Answer. Slip. The difference between the theoretical discharge and actual discharge is called the slip of the pump. The slip of a reciprocating pump is negative when then suction pipe is long and delivery pipe is short and the pump is running at high speeds. Question number 40. What is specific speed of centrifugal pump? 
Answer. Specific speed of centrifugal pump. The specific speed of centrifugal pump is defined as the speed of an imaginary pump identical with the give pump, which will discharge one liter of water while it is being raised through a head of one meter. Question number 41. Describe air vessel. Answer. Air vessel. The air vessel, in a reciprocating pump, is a cast iron closed chamber having an opening at its base. These are fitted to the suction pipe and delivery pipe close to the cylinder of the pump. The vessels are for the following purposes, to get continuous supply of liquid at a uniform rate. To save the power required to drive the pump. This is due to the fact that by using air vessels, the acceleration and friction heads are reduced. Thus the work is also reduced. Question number 42. Define hydraulic rem, accumulator and lift. Answer. Hydraulic REM, in hilly areas, a large volume of water available at low heads is utilized to lift a small volume of water to a great height by means of a hydraulic REM. Lift, the force perpendicular to the direction of the parallel flow, or a main free stream, which in general, is known as the lift. 